What is up guys, it is Nick. We are back on AFK Arena and we have a new hero drop today. Uh, that is Rowan and Rowan is a light bearer character. He's an interesting character. Uh, he's got this dazzle which Rowan throws copious amounts of gold coins onto the battlefield with three random targets. Uh, which three random targets will receive every 0.5 seconds. If the coins are collected by any allies, they will recover 50 energy points, and their attack ratings will be increased by uh, 30% uh, for 8 seconds. If the coins are received for any enemies, they will be stunned for 4 seconds. Uh, he also has Avian Assault. Rowan's Duck attacks the nearest enemy multiple times uh, for 60% damage, each causing the enemy's accuracy to drop by 120 points for 10 seconds while also allowing Rowan to steal 80 of the enemy's energy points. Uh, he also has healthy supplies. Uh, after entering the battlefield, Rowan sets up a supply stall and places three health potions upon it. When a nearby ally health, health drops below 50%, a potion will be used to restore 30% of their max health. Each hero may use a potion once every five seconds. Uh, when Rowan receives damage that exceeds 10% of his max health, he will use his energy to mitigate the damage, causing him to lose an... Energy instead of health. This ability can be used once every three seconds. Energy loss when using this ability is determined by the damage which is mitigated. A maximum of 80 energy points can be used to mitigate damage. So he's kind of a support healer. Um, but the Dazzle makes him more of a, a little bit of a crowd control support healer. Because he can, uh, if he throws these gold coins out there and an enemy picks them up... Um, Let's see here. Uh, which three random targets will receive every 0.5 seconds? Where's the enemy one? If the coins are received by the enemy, they are stunned by for four seconds. Um, and so it has some crowd control aspects to it because he can get he can stun enemies for a brief moment of time. We're gonna be doing summonings. I'm on my second character. I have not done anything on this character. Um, yeah, I, I have not done a single thing on this character to um, summon or anything like that. I think I did one ten summon because it was at the very beginning of the game, and I needed I needed some I needed some uh, heroes to do anything. So um, this is the team right now over here: the Labyrinth, Shamira, the Day Seven, Belinda, Tazi was the one elite hero that I pulled. I think she's just basically yep. Uh, so we're going to be looking for that type of stuff. But you can see we got 20,000 coins and I have all of this stuff in here. Uh, so we're going to pop these. Get our 60 diamonds there. And our 30 diamonds here. Okay, so let's get into this. Let's start off with popping our regular rares. So we'll pop them. Um, we'll do five to start out with and see what we get. Um, all right. I think I want to run a Light Bearers team, maybe. Either a Light Bearers and Shamira or a Wilder Shamira. I'm not quite sure what I want to do yet. So, anything. I mean, I'll take the uh, the Graveborns as fodder for Shamira, but other than that, I don't really need them. Obviously, we're not looking for anything too exciting here because I like some Muriels because I do want to use her if I do use a Light Bearers team. So, any Muriels I can get is good. Got a bunch of Nerus. We're going to unlock a bunch of more gems, so we'll see exactly um, how many more summons that we can do. So I have enough for two elite summons. So let's pop the first one. And we've got Thane. So that's not a bad pull. Um, pretty happy about that. Uh, he's a pretty decent light bearer. Not great, but, but decent. So that's a nice pull. And then we got a Belinda. Okay, I will take that. Um... That should mean that we're pretty close to getting Belinda to Legendary. So if I go over here, Light Bearers, Belinda. Oh, I just need regular Elite Pluses. Um, I don't even need. I don't even need that Belinda to get her to Legendary. I need the Belinda to get her to Legendary Plus though. But here we go to the Noble Taverns. You can see I have a ton of different scrolls as well. So let's start into this. If I pull Rowan, I will definitely go Light Bearers, but let's see here. So, oops, not a great start there. Four blues, and good, we got an Elite to kick it off. What did we get? We got ourselves, ooh, a Lucius, I'll take that. He's 
one of the best tanks in the game and he's the best tank for light bearers so if i'm going to use light bearers on this character that's a great pull so let's do the next we got uh, 22 of these hit the wrong level there but you know what we'll uh we'll mix it up this time so we got all blues we got a muriel it sounds really dumb that i'm excited to get a muriel but i do want to try to use her on this light bearers team so uh it's all good we have two solo ones here so we got a sylvina blues out of these always make me happy out of the single summons so um not too picky there so let's get the heart ones out of the way because these have pretty bad odds at anything good i mean the odds are way far against you that you pull a purple or an elite so i think i did on my main account i did pull an elite out of one of these which was ridiculous never thought that would happen but i got like super lucky so but this is good. It gives you some fodder as long as you get blues um, every day. I mean, it's got like half the percent of a chance of a, an elite, so it's kind of worthless. Okay, so let's go ahead and do this. This is our 10 scroll light summons from the uh, seven day uh, that gave you Belinda. Okay, please have an elite in the final one. Yes, okay, thank you. I only had one 10 summon here. I just wanted a chance. Okay, we got Fox. I really like Fox, so that's another good light bearer that we picked up. I think my ideal team would be Lucius, Shamira, Rowan, Belinda, Fox, probably. Um, I want to use Muriel, but uh, obviously if I get teams that are better than having Muriel on there, I'm not using Muriel. Okay, so now we have all of these gem summons. Uh, I gotta clear up some hero slots. This is probably gonna happen a decent amount. Because I really haven't spent any money on this character uh, or this account, so um, it means that I don't have all that much space. Because I don't have any VIP and anything like that. Okay, so back to the tavern. And let's go ahead and summon. I'm going to mix it up this way. Let's go to the middle first. Wow, that is terrible. Wow, that wow, that was an awful summon. Okay. Okay, that was some utter trash. Man, these summons are really bad. I got an elite, thankfully, but man, these summons are terrible. Oh, we got a Shamira. I will take that. Got the Shamira. Ugh, so ugly, but we did get an elite. It's a lot of greens. Okay, Morvis, I'll take that. I will take the Morvis. No double elites. We did pick up a Sylvina, so we'll have some uh, fodder for Shamira. Nothing to... Eh, that's a little bit better with the with the rares, at least. Just misclicked again. And no elite to end off, but I don't know. Five is still not that good. I mean, you have a 50-50 chance, so I can't be too mad. All right, we got an elite. And eh, 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 if I was going... If it's going Wilders, that would make sense to have a Kaz, but I don't think I'm going to go Wilders, so. Ugh, such an ugly start when you get a bunch of greens on the bottom. All right, only three blues. Please be an elite. That's ah, just a blue. Man, terrible. This has been really bad. Really terrible. Send those up. Uh, let's go to Rickety Cart. Retire Heroes. Auto Select. There we go. Retire all of those guys. Okay, back to the Noble Tavern. And we'll pop this. I'm going to save the selected summon till the very end. Elite, please. Elite. Oh my gosh. Woo, these were terrible. Absolutely awful. Okay, so we can complete some weeklies and stuff. So pop those. Pop that. And head to campaign. Yeah, we didn't complete anything that gives me any gems. It's kind of rough. Let's grab all of these. And probably have some... I don't think... We didn't get enough. We didn't get 15 new characters. So, alrighty. It's time to... Well, we can pop this first. Okay, a Morvis. Not bad. We could, It's time for our selective summon. Uh, see if we can get uh, Rowan... Um, because this video was not very good. We did not get very many elites. Not too happy about that. But I'm going to get the team all set up. And then in the next video we can do a little bit of campaign pushing on this character. But here we go. 
What do we get out of our light bearers thing? And okay, we got a Belinda. Not not bad. I think that means I can get Belinda to legendary plus. Uh, let's go ahead and try that real quick. We can try to get Belinda legendary plus. Uh, I think I have to. Um, I'm gonna have to fodder stuff. Hogan. That only gets Hogan to elite. Uh, Hogan again? No, wait. Uh, let's get rid of this dude. Got three copies of Morvis. Okay, so is this to get to elite plus? Ah, I can't even do it. I'm one, I'm one short. I can get, or actually, yeah, I'm one short. I'm one short of being able to get, uh, to get legend, wait, hold on. No, because this, yeah, okay, actually we can do it. Let's see here. Let's do this. I was a little off. I gotta do this to get to Elite Plus. And then now we can do this and get Belinda to Legendary. And then get Belinda to Legendary Plus. So nice. Got our first Light Bearer up uh, in, uh, in Ascension level. And so now we just gotta kinda hang out wait get the rest of our characters up and then uh push the story but guys that's gonna do it for this video i hope you all enjoyed drop it a big old like if you did subscribe if you have not and i'll catch you guys in the next video peace